Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Adrija, a current fourth year student at Ramaya Institute of Technology. And if you have followed my channel, you very well know that I make videos related to college guidance, campus tour, etc. So today's video is going to be on the CET 2025 roadmap, where I am going to tell you that how you can get a good rank in CET along with your board exams, how you are going to manage both of them, and how I got a rank of 3.4k during my time, what are the mistakes I did, and how you should try to avoid So them. first of all, let's start with the CET exam pattern. As you know, it consists of physics, chemistry, maths, and biology. So for engineering students, it's just PCN and you get 60 questions. Usually, it's you're given 80 minutes to solve those 60 questions. It's a pen and paper exam where you have to circle the MCQs on an OMR sheet. So it takes a lot of time. So you need to really practice using your OMR sheet at your home because it's very different from the computer-based test. And so it is very important to give CET mock test along with the timer kept on. Now I'm gonna tell you that how you're gonna study, you have three months left, that is Jan, Feb and March. Your exam will be mostly in April. So how you're going to divide your time equally for boards as well as CET? First of all, when you're studying for the board exam, you're going to focus mainly on February and March while studying for the boards. But for CET, you're going to start the preparation now, that is in January. So when you're studying for CET, the main thing is that you need to revise concepts and then you have to solve the past year questions from the CET papers of, the, of those topics. So now let me tell you the timetable that you're going to follow for studying for CET as well as boards simultaneously. Because as you know, in CET, 50% of the weightage is for your board exams out of 300 and 50% of the weightage is for your CET out of 180 marks. So you need to get about 290 plus in boards and then you can get lower marks in CET about 140 plus so that your rank comes below 1000. So this is how you are going to do division between your board marks and your CET marks to get a good rank. If you want a rank below 1000 for a good college, then you have to definitely score well in your board exam as well as do well in your CET. So target 140 plus in your CET for now. Even 120 is a good score, but if you're doing very well in your boards, then you can relax in CET. But if you're doing bad in your boards, then you need to work hard in your CET. So I'm going to divide the timetable into two parts. First is for the weekday timetable where you're going to study for 5 hours and the next is the weekend timetable where you're going to study for 8 to 10 hours. So 5 hours is excluding your coaching and school hours. So suppose you're going for school from 9 to 3. If you're an early bird then start studying from 5 to 7 in the morning. If you're a late night bird then you have to study in the night from 11 to 1. And the other time slot that is from 6.30 so like 8.30 is going to be common for everyone in the evening. So totally you have to study 5 hours, 2 hours in the morning or 2 hours in the night and then 3 hours in the evening that is from 6.30 p.m. to 8.30 p.m. is your 2 hours study and 1 hour is going to be your mock test and the past year questions that is from 8.30 p.m. to 9.30 p.m. And definitely don't miss out sleeping for 8 hours, it's a must because when you get good sleep then only you can study nicely. Now let's come to the weightage of different topics from 11th and 12th. So as you know that 11th carries less weightage than 12th topics. So your main focus for now should be to complete all the important topics from 12th and then if time permits you can go back and revise the 11 topics. So for now in January focus on completing the syllabus and the important topics. Then in February and March you have to mainly focus on your board exams and then towards the April you have to revise everything for CET, give regular mock tests and solve many past year questions. Mainly everything the focus should be on CET during that time. So this is how you're going to divide the period of three months from now on. Now let's come to the mistakes that I did during my time due to which I couldn't get a rank below 1000 but I got 3.5k rank by which I was getting electronics in Ramaya. So what I did was I was focusing only on one thing. I was just studying for either both or either for entrance exams like JE, Comet K and CET. So I was like completely uh, focusing on one thing rather than giving my time alternatively to each thing. So that is one of the most important points that you should keep in mind that when you're studying for both, you should focus on that. But you should not neglect CET PYQs, Comet K PYQs and also even JE PYQs. When you're then the second point is that when you're studying for JE, you automatically get prepared for CET as well as Comet K. 
बिकॉज जे इज हायर लेवल क्वेश्चन एंड सी टी एंड कॉमिट के लाइक कंपेरेटिवली लोअर लेवल क्वेश्चन सो इफ यूर प्रिपेयरिंग फ्रॉम अ स्टूडेंट्स परस्पेक्टिव इफ यूर थर ओ विथ जे दिन लेट्स गो यू गोन डू डेफिनेटली वेल इन सी टी बट द ओनली थिंग इज दैट यू शुड प्रैक्टिस टाइम मैनेजमेंट द वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग इज ड्यूरिंग माई एग्जाम एन आई वॉज गोइंग टू राइट सी टी आई मिस ऑन सॉल्विंग थ्री टू फोर क्वेश्चन बिकॉज ऑफ टाइम आई फोकस मेनली ऑन लाइक सॉल्विंग वन क्वेश्चन दैट आई लॉस टाइम इट वॉज ओनली सिक्सटी मिनट फॉर सिक्सटी क्वेश्चन जूनिंग दैट टाइम सो आई हैड टू बेसिकली डू एवरी क्वेश्चन इन लेस दिन अ मिनट अदरवाइज एंड हैड टू सर्कुलेट ऑन द ओ एम आर ऑल्सो सो दैट इज वाई एम टेलिंग यू गाइज दैट यू स्टार्ट गिविंग मॉक टेस्ट ऑफ सी टी फ्रॉम नाउ इट्स सेल्फ सो दैट वेन यू गो देर यू विल हैव द नॉलेज इन योर माइंड बट वॉट इफ यू कैंट एक्जीक्यूट इट ओवर देर यू नीड टू पुल इट ऑन पेपर इफ यू डोंट सर्कुलेट ऑन द ओ एम आर दिन वॉट इज यूज यू जस्ट सॉल्व एंड कैप द क्वेश्चन सो द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट थिंग इज यू नीड टू प्रैक्टिस मॉक टेस्ट पुट अ थ्री आर टाइमर गिव अ वन आर टाइमर एंड इफ यू सॉल्विंग वन सब्जेक्ट गिव अ वन आर टाइमर इफ यू सॉल्विंग ऑल सब्जेक्ट्स टूगेदर गिव थ्री आर टाइमर एंड सर्कल इट ऑन द ओ एम आर विच इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट सो दीज आर द मिस्टेक्स आई डेड ड्यूरिंग माई टाइम विच इज मेनली टाइम मैनेजमेंट एंड फोकसिंग ओनली ऑन बोथ योर सी टी सो यू डेफिनेटली अवॉइड दिस एंड इफ यू नीड एनी मोर हेल्प रिगार्डिंग सी टी और कॉमेंट के प्लीज कमेंट इट बिलो और इवन यू कैन डी एम मी ऑन माई इंस्टाग्राम आई विल ग्लैड टू हेल्प यू सो ऑल द बेस्ट फॉर योर सी टी एग्जाम्स द नेक्स्ट वीडियो इज गोन बी द इम्पॉर्टेंट टॉपिक्स दैट यू नीड टू कवर सो स्टे ट्यून टू माई चैनल फॉर दैट थैंक यू फॉर वॉचिंग टिल दी एंड दिस इज अतुजा सिंह साइनिंग ऑफ बाय सी यू